Are you ready for that lesson? Because I'm ready to eat. Uh, let's see who will win this match. Will it be Stanislav Chakarov or will it be Raul Alvial? What do you think? Do you think Raul has even the smallest chance of winning this game? Messi. Oh, beautiful. Oh. Absolutely beautiful. Lionel Messi strikes in 22 and Stanislav Chakarov has the lead. It's a wonderful finish from Chakarov, isn't it? Hey okay, fellas, how's everyone doing? Your FIFA teacher, Ricky BG here. Welcome to another FIFA 17 tutorial. Welcome to my channel and welcome to my new studio LOL. So today we will talk about the crosses in FIFA 17 and I will show you something special. Yes, I will teach you how to score all of your crosses in FIFA 17, how to score all of your chances. I will show you some uh, special technique. It's super, super effective and not that hard to perform. But before I move to the tutorial, it would be much, much appreciated if you show me your amazing support once again when you destroy the like button and also if you're new you're welcome to subscribe to my channel. Like that you'll receive notifications every time when I upload something new here. Now it's time for the lesson, we will talk again after that, enjoy! First of all, to perform the perfect cross, you need to use semi on your cross assistance. When you do that, let's start with one of the most important things and I'm sure that many many of you don't know about it and this is completely normal because you're not pro FIFA players. I know that uh, when you're playing for crosses, many of you are just pressing the cross button guys but the secret is that you need to hold one more button and this is the L1 button for the PlayStation users and the LB button for the Xbox users and then to press the cross button. When you do that your crosses will be more accurate, more powerful and impossible to stop if you follow the following steps. Now when you know that it's time to explain you what is the best area for performing that cross and actually you can see it right now on your screens, I've marked it with a green color. So when you're there the next and one of the most important things is the positioning of your player. He must be positioned always in front of your opponent's penalty box before performing the cross. And then all you have to do is to make the perfect cross towards the far post direction. And believe me, you will always have a player there if you're using the 4-2-2 formation. And by the way, I've already made a tutorial about the best possible tactics for that formation. And if you have missed it, then don't worry, you can find the link about it in the description. So in this situation, all that you need is to hold the A1 button if you're PlayStation users or the LB button if you're Xbox users plus the cross button and the cross power must be always more than 2 bars and more specifically it should be around 3 bars for the perfect cross and there you go believe me if you follow those steps and if you practice them a bit you will get used to that method without any doubts the crosses are so OP this year and I'm sure that when you use the crosses from this tutorial you will destroy many many players in one week when the full version of FIFA 17 will be here So that was today's FIFA 17 tutorial guys, did you like it, did you dislike it? In my opinion the crosses will be so so overpowered this year and I like that to be honest because normally I like to play a lot for crosses but we will see what will happen when the full version of FIFA 17 is here. So if you have any questions about that tutorial, any requests for some FIFA 17 tutorials, you know where is the comment section, just drop your comments there and as always I read and reply to all of them. For latest updates about me, you can follow me on Twitter, like my page on Facebook, as always I am also on Instagram, all links are in the description. My name is Taz, it was a big pleasure to make that FIFA 17 tutorial for you my friends. Don't forget to like and subscribe because Team Wiki is waiting for you. See you again later my friends, bye bye.